once there lived a rich man with his wife and children in a city the rich man was very pious whenever any monk visited that city he would call that monk to his home and serve him one day a monk came to the city and the rich man was told that a monk visited his city he went to that monk and welcomed him to his home and served him with food and fruits the rich man had some work in the city and so he left the home and said to that monk that he will return in the evening after taking food in the afternoon the monk questioned the rich man's wife in this way oh mother how many children do you have then the rich man's wife replied i have four children by the grace of god then the monk asked another question how much wealth do you have then she replied we have much wealth and so people call us lakpatis in the evening the rich man came to his home to send the monk to his monastery on the way the monk asked the rich man same questions what he asked the rich man's wife the monk asked the first question to the rich man how many children do you have then the rich man replied i have one son then the monk went into dilemma he thought like this when i asked the rich man's wife about the children they have she said that they have four sons then why this rich man is telling lies after some time the monk asked the second question how much wealth you have then the rich man replied my wealth is 50000 rupees then the monk thought in his mind that when i asked the rich man's wife about their financial condition she said that they are lakpatis but why this man is telling me all lies then after walking some distance the monk asked his third question how many years are you old then the rich man replied I am 40 years old. Then again the monk thought like this. It appears to me that the rich man may be having around 70 years. But why he is telling me that his age is 40 years only? The monk couldn't resist this and asked the rich man as to why he is telling all lies. Then the rich man folded his hands and said like this. O oh, great ones I know that lying is a sin so I don't lie with anyone and specially to great monks I will never lie then the rich man continued I have four sons but only one son is obedient to me so I said that I have only one son then the rich man said O oh, great ones your second question was about my wealth I consider the amount i spent in charity is my real wealth and so i said that i have only 50000 rupees as i spent only that much amount for charity and the rich man continued to say like this your final question was about my age i have taken initiation from my master 40 years back so i consider only that 40 years as my age Then after listening to the rich man the monk smiled and gave his blessings to the rich man and left for his monastery Friends from this story we must learn that the one who cares his parents is a real son when the parents become old most of the children leave them and don't take care of them those children who take no care of their parents are sinners secondly the rich persons must donate some percentage of their wealth to the needy and spend some time in doing some good services to the society the money which we donate for good works is a real money which gives us happiness and joy the age we spend in spiritual practices like serving god and meditating are really the true years 
which we spend meaningfully so we must be obedient to our parents give some money as donation to the needy and spend the time for spiritual practices so be good and do good this is all of any religion thank you for watching friends if you like in my video please subscribe my channel and click on bell icon below please like and share the video please support my channel to grow